Look, I got enemies, got a lot of enemies, got a lot of people trying to drain me of my energy. Well, I'm, I'm here to provide a service, and that's... What's that's, the service right now you're providing? Um, well, people ask me to come by and just make sure that no one's rights are being violated, yours or anyone else's. Well, how would we violate them when we're in public? Hey guys, News Now California, out in the city of Long Beach. I'm at the Long Beach City Hall. I'm out here today with SGB News First. We're gonna see if they respect our right to film in public. They're doing a lot of construction here and that's why it's so loud behind me. Six elevators. I want to thank all of the support all my subscribers uh, give me. Thank you. I can't make this channel without you guys. And for if you're new to the uh, channel, please like, share, and subscribe my videos. It's most appreciative. Hey boss, are there any public lobbies upstairs? I'm not sure. How can we find out? You can, you can go upstairs and, and uh, yeah, you can go upstairs if you guys need to see something from a department. What other departments are up there? All types of departments. Uh, public works. Public works? Uh, financial management. Okay. Well, they all have doors to a lobby, right? Um, some of them are, once you step out, it's like, uh, uh, there's a desk there and there's a phone you can use or someone sitting there. Okay, thanks, man. Paul Harris didn't get that Albert This is Public Works Engineering Bureau, Inspection, Transportation, Planning, Human Resources Department, and Risk Management Bureau. So charter will be a communication. It will be a communication online. It will be separate. Well, this is good to see. They're open Monday through Friday, 7.30 to 4.30. A lot of city offices are even closed on Fridays. Okay. So Long Beach is uh, pro open. Sorry, so Manny, I'll put it over here. Okay, thank you. Much appreciated. You're welcome. We have a big uh, map over here for the city. Hey guys, thanks for respecting our right to come up and film. Appreciate it. No problem. You, you're fully aware. How are you fully aware of what we're doing? Of is legal. Oh, my boss was just right here, and she didn't say anything about it. So. Oh, that's how you knew. <laughs> Thank you. 
Yeah. You can thank her for us. Okay. Have a good one. There you have it. So, it appears that certain employees are educated about this and others aren't. But it'll spread. And that's what we want, the message to get out. This is the fifth floor. The Commercial Services Bureau, Planning Bureau, Tidelands Accounting Division. Putting it all together, the ERP project. And the Tidelands Division. Hey gals, what's the Tidelands Division? What is that? Do you know? Yeah. Um, the Tidelands for it's not here anymore. It's in the sixth floor. Gotcha. But what do they do? So they're, they're, they're the ones who accounts for the, anything that's close to the water. Meaning, yeah, oh, for building? Buildings, any accounting related stuff that related to close to the water. So let's say the parking lot for the pike. Mm -hmm. Oh, I got you. For development yeah. close to the water. Yes. Okay. They call that Tidelands. Perfect. Thanks for the explanation. You gals have a good day. All right. So that's what the Tidelands uh, division is about. Anything to doing with uh, new construction close to the ocean. Okay, well, that was swell. <coughs> there she is with her camera now. See her? Yeah. Came out with her camera. All their work for tomorrow, huh? Yeah, they left all their work for tomorrow. Fuck it, tomorrow's another day. Getting paid for doing nothing. Another day, another dollar. Oh, wow. Ira Hatch goes back to 1908 through 1912, was a city auditor. Wow, Laura Dowd, 2006 to present. Here's Murray Corson, a distinct uh, look of Jack Benny. So here's Louis Schumann, David Rankin, and then Charles Boynton, and they all look the same. This seems very odd. Hey, okay. I'm just gonna get around here. Oh, yeah, go Thanks, man. Yeah, they have pictures of the same people. What's up? What's up? You up babysitting us or something? Hey, I'm just I'm just here to somebody, make sure no one gets to somebody called you on us? Yeah. What'd they say? That we're in a public lobby doing something legal? Well, you know, it's a natural reaction for people to get a little bit defensive when people get filmed. So I'm just here to make sure that your rights aren't violated and no one else's are. Yeah, so yeah. just keep doing what you're doing. I'll yeah, stay out of your way. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. Okay. Do, 
you can't you can't just educate them from the get-go though and just tell them hey what they're doing is perfectly legal you shouldn't be afraid of a camera because that's what we're out here to do we're trying to take the fear factor away from people I, you know what we're doing yeah I know exactly right yeah, yeah. we have no ill intent yeah. no nefarious purposes and we're hoping as a law enforcement officer it doesn't get to this that you got to babysit us you could just say hey what they're doing I'll go up and say hey guys and then you can leave. But yeah. right now, really, there's no reason for you to be with us. Well, I'm, I'm here to provide a service, and that's... What's that's, the service right now you're providing? Um, well, people ask me to come by and just make sure that no one's rights are being violated, yours or anyone else's. Well, how would we violate them when we're in public? Well, and, and that's what I'm saying, not just yours. You know, I mean, I'm here to make sure that you're... You can go. Violated. You want to go or listen? No, I'm fine. Because sometimes you. people... You know, people call and tell us, there's people filming us, they can't do that. And sometimes it's my job to tell them, oh, oh yes, they can. Right. Did you tell them that? Well, I, they didn't ask me to do anything. I just showed up, let them know I was here. Just the same way I'm letting you. Right. No, I, I get what you're doing. But my question is, when you got the call, right. did you get a call from a, 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 a civilian or uh, in your department somebody called? Somebody approached you and came up to you? I just, I just got a, a call from a calling party. From a calling party? Yeah. And my question is, at the time that you acknowledged that call, did you at least tell them what we're doing is perfectly legal? Well, my job is to come up here and... and but and I know, I know, but right. see, that's where you can still come up. But if you, if you do that from the beginning, then right. they'll know. They're never going to know what we're doing is perfectly legal. Well, even if what you're doing is perfectly legal, they still may feel a little bit more comfortable if I'm, if I'm here. I, get, I know, I get it. I, I get it, but and, you're not hearing what I'm saying. If you can tell them that and still come up, then it's yeah. fine. Yeah. But they're never going to know by you coming up that what we're doing is perfectly and legal. I they did, won't know. And I did let them know. Oh, and you did? I asked you that, and, though. And, oh, I'm getting to that. Oh. And one of the things that I try to do throughout my day is if, if folks with cameras show up, they can record you. Right. It's okay. And, and that's really all I'm here to do. Man. Right. That, that's all. Right, right. That's all. Right, so, right. I can give you my business card with my name on it. I'm more than happy to no, help that, you. No, that's fine. My, my, yeah, that's fine. I'll take yeah, it. But see, sure. I asked you three times, and it, I guess it took you a while to get to that. <laughs> you should have just said, I told him, man. Yeah. And then it would have been good. I'm a storyteller, man. I, yeah. I like to take the, the scenic group to my point. So my apologies for that. Yeah, okay. There's my name, Martin Arroyo. All right, you're Martin. Nice to meet you. I'm Phil. Nice to meet you, Phil. Pleasure. Yeah, Welcome yeah. to City Hall. Yeah, yeah. All right. So where should we go next? Wherever you want to go, sir, in the building. You want to buy us lunch? Want to buy us lunch? You know, I've heard that before. Have you have you been in Oxnard? Yeah, I was. Yeah, I've seen that video. I mean, hey, that guy's willing to buy you lunch. I mean, he probably he's probably a little bit better off than I am because Oxnard pays really well. Yeah, that's funny. You saw my video there. <laughs> All right, I won't hold you to it, but maybe next time. All right. Buddy. All right. Take care. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna be around a while, so. Good luck. All right. Let me know if you have any problems with my, my number. Oh, I, I will. I will. All right, well, that was Officer Martin Arroyo. It took him I don't know how many times for me to ask if he educated those people, and he finally admitted he did, which is really what I wanted to hear, so that's all good. So now we were on to a different floor. Here's the mayor and city council. How you doing? All right, how are you? Good. Are you the mayor? <laughs> no. Okay. Well, you should be. Thanks. He wasn't the mayor, but he looked like a mayoral candidate. Oh, they have some nice, uh, nice things here. I'm not sure what the sister city for Long Beach is. Maybe it's an Asian, uh, an Asian country with all these Asian, Asian uh, antiques in this curio cabinet. Oh, here we go. This is interesting. Look at this. The 14th floor floor warden. That's an interesting name. That sounds very authoritative. Hey buddy, are you, are you the 14th floor floor warden? I'm one of them. Why do they call it a floor warden? It's, it's... They should change that name, don't you think? 
we are. We're going to change it to the eleventh floor when we move. And get rid of floor warden. I mean, it's enough that we're changing it to eleven. We have to change the warden. That's just that's asking a lot. It is, huh? I have no idea. Wow. A warden. You didn't work in a penitentiary prior to coming here, did you? No. Okay, just check. Hey, what's the sister city to Long Beach? Is it an Asian country? Yes. What what country? China? I can't remember. We have a few sister cities, so I don't know which ones. Oh, okay. A few, huh? Because I saw the Asian art, I thought it was one. But there's a few. There's, yeah, we have more than one sister city. But are they all Asian sister cities? I think so. Okay. So. All right, we'll let, we'll let you get back to uh, containing the convicts as the 14th floor, floor warden. Well, that was interesting, at least for me. That's an odd name. But... Are you here for to meet someone? No, we're not here to speak. We're just out here doing a public information story in a public lobby. Okay. Are you filming right now? Yeah. Okay. You didn't ask for my permission. I don't need to. To publicize it. I mean, it's just polite, though. Okay. You want to give me your permission? You didn't ask. No, you said it would be polite, so I'm being polite. Okay. But who says I'm, I'm publishing anything? How can I help? Is that Martin? How can I help? You already did. You answered all my questions, okay. and then and then you came back. You were you were very I, I, I you, you were somebody, very professional. I thought somebody had already helped you, so I was I thought you were waiting for someone. Then I just not at all. So then I asked, have they been helped? And said, and somebody said, no, not yet. So oh well, you didn't you didn't ask me. Okay. So you're all good. Yeah, we, I don't need, need your help. You answered all my questions. Okay. You acted very uh, courtesy, uh, professional, and cordial, so I thank just, you. You know, it, it, it is polite, though, just to let someone know that you recorded them and when you're asking the question. Okay, <laughs> well, it's also kind of intuitive if you see me pointing a camera at you that you could ask, are you recording me? <laughs> it isn't? You have a good day. You too. <laughs> it's funny. That was pretty funny. He would be a comedian, though. Yeah, you'd be polite. Yeah, it'd be polite that when I record in public, people don't hit me and grab my camera, too. Okay, were they going to call out the troops now? He says it's not intuitive to ask somebody if they're recording them when the camera's pointing at them. <laughs> we are good. Okay, he's left with his uh, colleague. I can see through this backdrop window here, the reflection. Dude, here, look. If you point it that way, you get that whole back room. So I need a public official's approval to film in a public building. Well, as you can see, ladies and gentlemen, we are up high. 
and we are on the 14th floor. Which, is this a top? I don't know. I'm assuming it is, although assumptions can get people into trouble, but considering it's the mayor's office, it probably is the top floor. All right, guys, we're going to hit another one here. Not sure where. Want to hit it, man? Let's go to another floor. Okay, let's take our, yeah, we are at the top of the 14. Where should we hit? 13? All right, we're going down one floor. Excitement galore. Good, you? Oh, we're just filming. Just filming, taking a look around. How you doing? How was lunch? Great. Great. What's good to eat around here? Everything. Oh, okay, cool. They have. They don't have a cafeteria here. No. That's a bummer. Yeah, it would be convenient and cheaper. Man, this is nice. All wood paneling. All you're missing is a cigar room. I know, right? A little bit old school over here, huh? Big time. Yeah, but we'll be upgrading soon. Really? Yep. Are you a Are you a floor warden also? No. Are you familiar with that term? Yes. Where does that originate from? I don't Okay, because I tried to get it from the mayor's uh, receptionist, and uh -huh. he had no idea either. Oh, uh, okay. But sound doesn't sound good to me. Sounds too authoritative. Uh, yeah, but, but it's not like that. Yeah. So. Let's see what else we got. Why don't they call it something like floor florist? That would be better. Yeah. It would be friendlier. <laughs> yeah, it's friendlier. Yeah. Yeah. Or floor, how do you do today, sir? Yeah. Well, what does it sound like? Uh, well, it sounds scary, but it's more of like uh, someone, I guess, keeping an eye on the floor. And there you go, sure keeping an eye on the floor. Mm -hmm. Don't mind me, you want to keep working. I'm not offended by you filming, but I've got things I we have won't to stick sure. it. We won't, we won't bother you with our questions anymore. You've been very uh, professional and cordial, and we, we appreciate it. Thank you. And if we see Martin Arroyo again, tell him that. You know Martin. I do. He stops by every day. Yep. Yeah. Okay, you have a good day. Thank you as well. Okay, bye. Bye-bye. Hey, one last thing. Yes. I'm sorry to interrupt you. One last yes. thing. Uh, tell Patrick we say hello. Patrick, what? The city manager. Yes, you got it. There you go. All right. Okay, bye. All right, everybody, it does appear that the Long Beach City Hall does respect the First Amendment and respected our right to film in public. And for that, I want to thank them. So for SGV News First and News Now California, I'll catch you on the next one. Bye now.